Trina's not going anywhere. Okay. <laughs> She's just feeling, feeling hemmed in. Well, thank you for talking to her and helping her get some of that out. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna ask you a question. Would you mind possibly playing for us tonight? Sure, sure if you like. I, I would. <laughs> yeah, I, I actually would. <laughs> yeah. Does your illness ever, I don't know, get in the way of your playing? Marshall, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to keep going down this road. No, 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 it's okay. I'm sorry. It's okay. No one's, no one's ever asked. The only way schizophrenia got in between me and my music is when I had to go underground mm. to protect my family from the stigma. So it never inhibited your performance? No, not just my ambitions. Mm. Well. <laughs> Well, I'm a question. I guess I'm just curious <laughs> that none of your previous doctors even suggested genetic counseling or screening like Curtis had. That stuff wasn't around when I was in the hospital. Yeah, but nowadays, things like that are pretty much commonplace. Have you ever, you know, maybe, have you ever considered it? What's the point? I already have a diagnosis. What would genetic counseling tell me that I don't already know? What would be the benefit after all these years to get confirmation of what I already know? <laughs> oh, well, look at this. <laughs> Somebody enjoyed the pie, I see. Yeah, that I barely got to taste. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, Pop, you ready to watch some football? Let's do this. Yes, yes. 